Good evening, everyone. I'm Chris O'Rourke, and topping our news on this Thursday, November 12th, is the continuing effort to bring a community art center to Danville. The man who renovated Lewisburg's campus theater was in the building for the past two days. John Hartman was busy today unearthing an old stencil that was probably original to the building, but had been covered by four layers of paint. Hartman has been doing work like this for years, including a stint with the Commonwealth. He says they have spent the past two days looking at what the color scheme may have been and for any original elements that may have been removed but are still in the building. He says the goal would be to restore the theater to what it looked like before. Our game plan is to at least come up with a plan to move forward to the next step. So, okay, if we found these colors, then what? Then it's going to be kind of coming back with a plan to how do we maybe make a big mock-up of a section of the wall so that uh, potential people that might be funding this or interested in the project could come in and look at it and see what this might look like when it's finished. We're told the old ticket window exists in pieces in the building, and you can see that the original curtain still hangs in front of the screen. Hartman says they've also determined that the stage was extended, and the original orchestra pit is underneath with the original rails, woodworking, and colors. The building's current owner also showed an old advertisement he found for a movie that was set to play at the theater in 1961. Hartman's visit is all part of the process of the Danville Business Alliance, to determine the feasibility of restoring the building and making it into a community arts center and whether the community is interested in taking on the project, which could run as much as $3 million. Hartman told us he thinks it's definitely possible to bring this building back to its glory.